fantastic. Give me one quick moment to get the Instagram up and running. I am self-moderating today. It is just me holding down the whole fort. So be a little patient with me. I'm gonna get the Instagram running and then I will do my opening spiel of a deal. But let me know who is here, who's in the house, you guys. Don't be shy. I wanna hang out with you. Let's catch up. I'm good. There we go. Instagram friends. Hi. Hello. How are you? Can't see your comments over there. So please join us over at the website, luxurypromise.com. 19 of you guys. Thank you for being here nice and early with me. So Ned says, how are you? Hi guys. Happy Monday. So as mentioned, I am self-moderating today, you guys, from now until like 545 EST time. Hi, Daniela. Hi, Jane. How is it in Alabama right now? Surely I've missed you. I miss all of you guys. I am back. <laughs> I'm holding down the fort, as I mentioned, self-moderating today. Hi, Farah. How are you guys? So before I go over the opening spiel of a deal, yes, it is true. Every item in my show is already under the handbag icon. I kind of picked a lot more than I normally do because if I'm self-moderating, it, it's easier for you guys to look through, see what you want. Let me know what you want to see. I can talk you through it, but it's all already there. So Let's go over our opening spiel of a deal and then let's get into it. Today's show is all about things I consider to be great gifts. Hi Jennifer, how are you? I'm really missing the California weather. If you guys don't know, I am originally from California. It's starting to get chilly over here. So I tried to pick a lot of good giftable things. Everything in this show is under a thousand pounds. Every single piece is under a thousand pounds. I have some box items. I have a plethora of jewelry, small leather goods, just good gifts, stocking stuffers, if you will, that I thought you guys might be interested in today. Shell, how are you? All right, so first and foremost, anything that is purchased today will promptly be shipping out of New York City bright and early tomorrow. Your customs and your duties are covered on any items purchased during the live show. We accept all major forms of payment, credit cards, debit cards, Apple Pay, PayPal, you name it, we accept it. And last but not least, if you want to get your item instantly, but you do want to take time to finance it and pay it off in monthly installments, we do offer you guys that option with Split It. With Split It, you just have to make sure, one, that you select it at checkout, two, that you are using a credit card. It only works with credit cards, and you just have to make sure you have the item's total amount available as a credit on your credit card. If that's the case, you are good to go. And yeah, let me know if there's any questions, you guys. Today's vibe, I was channeling like Y2K pink shoddy vibes, if you will. I don't know, it was raining this morning, it ruined my hair. So I threw on this Chanel bandana from the 90s and I called it a look, okay? So you guys, let me know if there's any requests to start us off. Take a look through the handbag icon, shout it out. Let me know what you guys are here to see. Do you want small leather goods, jewelry? bags i have a little bit of everything and as i mentioned everything is under a thousand pounds today which is so so good ah, thank you shell thank you guys <laughs> i don't know where to start i'm a little overwhelmed with these options i might start with a little small leather good unless someone says otherwise so let's do it this is going to come as a box set with the ribbon. Yes, Jennifer, starting with small leather goods. You guys feel free to shout out anything specific that you see too. Everything's already up, but let me start off strong. Let me just get the price of this. So I will be pinning prices as I go. Just again, it's just me moderating. So doing my best, you guys. <laughs> okay, so we got this. It is cat. It's in like pristine condition. I'll do that and then I'll do the go yard then we can get into some jewelry but first I have an iridescent navy emprunt leather Louis Vuitton key pouch. You guys love the key pouches every time I have them they tend to sell and I don't think I've ever had one that does come as a set. So you get the box and the gift ribbon with this bad boy. This is such a nice color. I've never actually had this color. Thank you, Zanessa. Yeah, I was feeling a little retro. Like I kind of was going for 90s, but now I feel like I'm low-key more like 50s. <laughs> Look at this, you guys. So this is a navy colored emprunt pebbled Louis Vuitton leather key holder paired with silver hardware. I think this is so nice. Really, really beautiful gifting option. It's an absolute pristine. Oh, it does come. Okay, it's a true full set. It does come with its dust bag too and little LV papers. This is such a good one, you guys. Here is a look at the interior. 
this is like a 9.99 .9 out of 10 condition situation happening coming with box dust bag ribbon it is pristine unused condition level you guys and available for just 385 pounds which is 467 us dollars again the retail prices for these items will be in the description you guys let me know if there's any questions i'm moving fast because there's a lot to go through but i can always recap if you guys need so let's do this go yard situation up next the other day i had another go yard card holder but it was like just a true simple card holder this one has a little bit more organization going on it's a little bit larger so let me get this pinned the last one sold super super fast which i don't blame you guys it was really good So if you guys aren't familiar with Goyard, I honestly do equate them to the same level of prestige and struggle to get, like the struggle to get pieces new. I think Goyard's kind of on the same level as Hermes. Other people will equate Goyard with Chanel, but to me, Goyard and Hermes are kind of the same situation where you do have to play a game to get the pieces that you want. But I'm here, you guys can not even bother with that game because I do get Goyard flowing in here pretty regularly. <laughs> So all of these pieces are hand painted, really, really nice. So this is our Goyard St. Mark card wallet. It's just a simple bifold up and down in the green. You get the logo right there. Literally, if you don't have a Goyard store near you, like you don't have options. Like they don't sell online. Like it's just, it's so hard to get Goyard new, you guys. So on this side, you get three card holders. You have the Goyard logo embossed into the leather over here. I really love the stitching details on this piece. Over here, you get a little cutout. So you could put your ID in this pocket or your business cards, whatever it is. But this item is in a really excellent condition level. Another solid like 9.9 .9 out of 10. The only thing is this one is just going to come as is with a luxury promise dust bag for you guys. So if you are interested, she is available for 585 pounds and that is 710 US dollars you guys i forget who it was someone's been on the hunt for huggy earrings recently and i did find two good huggy earring options today let me know if that was you but also let me know what you guys want to see everything is up so you can shout out specifically what you want but i might go through both of the huggy earrings to kick off jewelry in today's show so let me just get these up for you guys i'm gonna start with the white gold option and they are rainbow sapphire, you guys, which is so nice. Five, three, four, four. And the price point on this is silly, absolutely silly. <laughs> guys, I'm so excited for Halloween tomorrow. Who else is excited? It's my favorite holiday. Okay, so up next are our 14 karat. Hi, Ray, how are you? Happy Monday. We have 14 karat white gold rainbow sapphire huggy earrings. They are quite tiny in size. Definitely recommend you guys for the jewelry to click to see more images. These ones specifically will show you an example of them worn on the ear so you can get a better idea of like what that looks like on the ear. <laughs> but oops, this was meant to be 318 pounds, not 215 pounds, you guys. Let me edit that real quick. Sorry, again, one woman show, mistakes will happen, but I'm on the hunt, <laughs> I'm trying my best. So let me try to show these to you guys. Again, they're really tiny and dainty. I might just show one. Definitely take a look at the additional images in the listing. They're super cute. For me, I would probably wear these like in my second piercing hole because I have a bigger hoop in my first one, but let me have the camera. So it's 14 karat white gold hence the friendly price point, but then you get little white, pink, darker pink, blue, more white that fades back into pink. So kind of just a girlier take on a rainbow motif for these earrings, you guys. These are made for us here in New York City, so they are brand new, never been worn, pristine, pristine condition from our jeweler here. So take a look at the images, but they are just 315 pounds, which is 382. US dollars. I'll also show you, I do have the same earrings, but in rose gold. So let me get those up next for you guys. And again, don't be shy, request what you wanna see. Take a peek through the handbag icon. 
lots of good jewelry options today. So the rose gold, I believe, are same price for the rose gold. Yes, Anna, of course, I'll do both of those right next. Aren't they cute, Daniela? I really like these. So let me do these earrings and I'll do both toiletry pouches up next. Finally, you guys, you guys always ask me for LV toiletry pouches and I always tell you to be patient, but today I managed to get my hands on two, which is really exciting and does not often happen for me. <laughs> so I'm really excited to have them. All right, so real quick, I do have the rose gold option as well. Same price as the white gold. They're 14 karat as well. Let's get it out. So this one's gonna be more of a true rainbow compared to the last one. This is a true rainbow. So you have 14 karat rose gold on these little huggies. Then you get red, pink, blue, green, and yellow sapphires set into this one. Same thing, these are made for us here in New York City. They are brand new, never been worn. And this one is also available for 315 pounds, which is 382 US dollars. And again, you can click on the icon down below to look at the images of these. Super, super recommend. You can see them worn on the ear there, get a better idea for their size. And the retail will be in the description too. We get these for super, super below what they retail for, which is amazing. All right, let's do some toiletry pouches. I'll start with the larger one first. The larger one is, first of all, larger, but it is up for a better price. The smaller one is a little pricier just because it truly is in like pristine condition. So let me start with the larger one. Let me just find it. So I have a size 26. Let me get the price up. Toiletry 26. This is such a good price, literally run. Get ready to run. Okay, so this is a size 26 Louis Vuitton toiletry pouch. This is the ultimate size for these organizers in my humble opinion. I think it is the most popular size, but if it's makeup, if it's work office supplies, if it's your charging cables, if you're traveling, whatever it is, there is always a need for one of these bad boys. So this one is going to be in more of a pre-loved condition. However, this one is made in France for you collectors out there. So you get Louis Vuitton here made in France to the back. So it's a little bit special. And then just, of course, your classic Louis Vuitton coded canvas monogram all over really excellent isn't it so good cat excellent exterior condition i'm looking at the corners these two corners are good just the idiotiest bittiest baby amount of corner wear i'm being really hypercritical on here so here's a look at the top as well let me open this up for you guys get it unstuffed and then wow so this is definitely a vintage one you guys i can just tell know a thing or two because i've seen a thing or two <laughs> that is so cute cat burgundy trendy not in this show i do have it pulled aside for you i'm so sorry i know i have to get back to your emails you guys it's been crazy grace was here i got caught up now sabrina's coming so i gotta get prepared but i saw your email and don't worry i do have that pulled aside for you just not in this show all right so you can definitely clutch this like cat is saying which always looks really really cute Again, this is the vintage version, so you're just gonna get a pebbled interior. Oh, and, and last time on my show, were you on that show where I was at home? Yes, no, I am in the office today, and thank you, it's rainy outside. My hair got ruined, so I threw on a bandana, an emergency Chanel bandana. Yeah, this one's made in France. So my guess is like 90s, possibly 80s on this, as it is made in France in the old school style. Price point is absolutely unbeatable. This one in the size 26 is up for just 395 pounds, which is 479 US dollars. Remember, you can split it on all of these items and they will be shipping out to you guys promptly tomorrow morning out of New York City. Stop it, and <laughs> You're too sweet. <laughs> Thank you, Rivia. Thank you guys for understanding. Ellen! Stop, I will cry. Oh my God. I, on November 16th, mark my word, I don't know what day of the week it is, but we're going to do a Louis Vuitton party special super show to commemorate our one year anniversary of our paths crossing in this crazy industry. I love that. Oh my God. Now I'm excited, Ellen. All right, let me do the other toiletry option I have. This one is in pristine, like new condition for you guys. So the price will be a little bit higher, but it is well, well worth it. 
So this is a size 15, which most people will use this one more for just like makeup, if that makes sense, just for the price. But you also can use it if you're someone that carries a lot of cash around or you just like an open concept wallet. This can definitely work out for you. So this is a size 15. As you can see by the leather, this is entirely untouched. It feels new, you guys. Here is a 360 on her. So smaller in size, but pristine, pristine condition for this piece. So let me open it up. The zipper is like ultra mega shiny gold. No issues. No way. Oh, you guys, November's gonna, oh my gosh. So many November babies. We're gonna have a month of celebrations for November. I'm excited. <laughs> so this piece, isn't it cute? I can do that one next. The price is silly, Isabel. So this will come with its Louis Vuitton dust bag for this little pouch. And then you have a completely unused interior on this. So this is like new 9.9 .9 out of 10 condition level. I'm a May baby personally, close to June. <laughs> and this is available for 555 pounds and that is 674 US dollars. And then I will just hold both of them up so you guys can have a visual size comparison. Remember the larger one is lower in price just due to its condition level, but it's still great vintage so here's the vintage 26 and then this is the smaller 15 that is not vintage so hopefully that's helpful you guys let me know if there's any questions at all all right let's do this fendi because this is like i mean it converts into a bag you could just use it as a wallet if you want to but it's priced cheaper than a retail fendi wallet and you get this whole situation which is so so cute I feel that NN. Honestly, there's so there's like a core group of you guys that like you guys understand my style, you understand my humor, like you get me, we get each other, and I love you guys so much for that. <laughs> okay, so up next, this is the cutiest, cutiest, cutiest little thing. Let me just get the um the price up. One three four seven one one. This price is silly. Silly, silly, silly. Someone has to run and grab this. Okay, so this is our Fendi Blue Leather Micro Flat Baguette. So cute. You guys, I love me a Scorpio. Scorpio is like my second favorite zodiac sign. <laughs> Look at this. No, the feelings are mutual in it. This is like a royal blue, not quite a deep blue. Maybe like a sky blue, sky blue, smooth leather paired with silver hardware. So like I said, you can either use this as a wallet as the strap does come off, but you do get a strap with this. So if you're someone that loves to rock a micro mini bag, like I am here for this. I think this is so stinking cute as an accessory or if you're just going out for dinner. If you're like me, me personally, I always have my phone in my hand. I could have the biggest bag in the world. My phone is still in my hand. I never let go of my phone. So I don't really care too much about bags fitting my phone. They just need to fit my Metro card, credit card, ID, and I'm good to go. <laughs> so, oh, Gemini is another close one. I would tie, I'm going to tie Gemini and Scorpios together because I love y'all but my favorite has to be Sagittarius because that's what my fiance is and that's what my mom is and it kind of it goes against what is said because like I'm a Taurus but for some reason I just me and Sagittarius always find each other all right let me show you guys the interior wow this still has seals on it how is this not sold yet <laughs> I mean I haven't even finished showing it but still it's too good so you get two card holders in the front, original little Fendi insert in here, and then you have an open concept with your inner logo here. You could probably put a lip gloss in here, I would say. Really cute, excellent pristine condition. And this one is going to come with its Fendi dust bag. So it's priced cheaper than a wallet, but you get a bag out of it. I love this option. I was glad I got my hands on it for you guys. So the price for this is just 475 pounds, and that is 576 US dollars for this pristine Fendi convertible wallet or mini micro baguette bag. Okay, let me know if there's any requests, you guys. Any other requests? I am happy, happy, happy to help with. I do have another Goyard piece that I think I'll show next since you guys know that I don't regularly get too much Goyard in. So when I do, it's a big deal to me at least. <laughs> so let me get this pinned. So this one I think would be a great giftable option. It does come with its big green Goyard box for you guys. It's called the Sonat MM pouch. Something passed down. 
the blue. Oh, I have a bunch of Tiffany. I have a lot of Tiffany today, Charnette. We'll get to it. <laughs> Look how nice this Goyard pouch is, you guys. So it comes with its dust bag and its box. Ooh, I'll do those next, Ellen. Remind me if I forget. So this is the like black and brown colorway of the Goyard house print. Again, always hand painted. You get a nice accent of like a orange and cream stripe right here. You get the brown trim, which I love so much. And then the back is just going to be plain without the stripe. You have the silver Goyard zip pull detail. Let me open this up. This is like new for sure comes with its little papers as well so it's a true full set and then this is so nice you get like a yellow canvas interior maybe a little bit of signs of wear in there you could definitely clean that so maybe more of an 8 out of 10 but the exterior looks absolutely pristine then you have a goyard branded brown leather card slot here so coming as a full set just the tiniest amount of discoloration to the inside is the only call out the rest of this piece is pristine and she is up and available for 715 pounds and that is 868 us dollars all right let's do these cutie cute cute butterfly earrings way let me find them there we go okay let me get these pins in real quick you guys thank you for being patient with me as i am self-moderating girl's gotta do what she's gotta do you guys <laughs> butterfly all right so these have 0.20 total carat weight of diamonds in them they are 14 carat white gold again also coming from our private jeweler creates for us here in New York City. So let me get one of these bad boys out. Again, for size reference against your earlobe, there is a picture of that in the listing. So definitely take a look-see. But these are fully micro pave diamond encrusted little butterflies. They are super, super sparkly. I feel like the carat weight looks higher than what it is just because it is entirely covered by the diamonds. And they are stud earrings. So against the ear, they're so sweet. And they're actually a really great size. Really cute. Flip the camera. And then here is a look at them. Like, look at all those little diamonds fully covering the butterfly wings. And it's not a flat butterfly. The wings do kind of curve in a little bit. So you do get that natural movement, which I love. Again, this piece is entirely unworn. It is brand new, never been used by anybody. Isn't it so cute, Daniela? And I personally, like, I understand a lot of people when it comes to investment jewelry pieces, I totally get that a lot of you guys are going to want 18 karat, sometimes even higher. But for me and the jewelry I wear every day, I've always been a 14 karat girly. Like this ring I wear every day is 14 karat. My chain gold bracelet, I shower in this and I have no issues. So 14 karat is just a little bit stronger actually, but you still can wear it in all situations and it doesn't tarnish. So I live, I stand for 14 karat. Obviously, 18 karat is amazing, but don't discount the 14, you guys. <laughs> it's saves you some money in your wallet to buy more jewelry, but it's still, to me, there's not any worry. Like, it's, I don't want to say it's the same. It's not the same, but to me, I wear it every day and have no issues. So, again, there's a look at the little earrings. I think these are so cute. <laughs> so, so cute. Um, and if you guys are interested, the diamond butterfly earrings, again, 0.20 karat weight of diamonds, and they are available for 425 pounds, which is 516 US dollars. And, and I'm going to put my email in the chat. I don't have any gold to show and I didn't have any gold included in today's show, but I am 90% sure that our jeweler can also make this piece in gold. So just shoot me over an email and I can talk with the jeweler and see if we can make that happen. Price point I'm assuming would be the same so shoot me an email i'll ask for you and we'll see what we can do you guys okay so let me know if there's any other requests again everything is set live and active right here right now let's what is this let's see are you guys ready for tiffany do i have tiffany girlies in the house if anyone is a larger size for cartier love rings I have a size 65, which is, I think, arguably the largest size I've had. It could be a good thumb ring, or if you are a larger size, or if you want to gift it to your husband, boyfriend, fiance, brother, uncle, whatever it is. 
See, I read your mind and then that's how connected we are. <laughs> so I do have that as an option. Okay, where should I go next? I am overwhelmed with choices, truly. Oh, I'm gonna close out with our jeweler jewelry pieces before I move on to others. So I do have this, my favorite, favorite ring. I don't have any just on clue rings today, Sharna. Everything's under a thousand in the show. And I didn't emphasize branded jewelry that much outside of like Tiffany and some Chanel, of course. But I can do another Cartier show soon. <gasps> Danica, how are you, my love? Happy Monday. All right, let's do my favorite, favorite ring. Let's see. I actually, I should get myself one of these, honestly. My fiance runs a art collective called Speed Snake Posse, and this is a snake ring, so I'm kind of using that as justification for me to get one of these for myself. <laughs> he can't get mad at me because I'll be like, no, I'm just, I'm just repping your art collective. It's fine. <laughs> yes, Danica, always. Look at this. I put in the work. <laughs> All right, so this is gonna be 14 karat. It is yellow gold with diamonds and Savorite gems. All of the diamond specs and the Savorite gemstone specs are in the description of this piece. So just click below, have a look-see. It is there for you, as well as the size, I believe. But you guys, this retails, I'm not lying. Retail price is right here. This retails for 1,305 US dollars. Okay, I said no, I said no. I brought it to you guys for the lowest possible price I could put it without getting in trouble. So this is just going to be 585 pounds, which is 110 US dollars. Really close to being entirely half off. But look at this. So you have micro puffy diamonds covering the front of the snake. The snake does wrap around the finger. I've gotten that like once or twice, say, or let me know if I'm saying your name right. I imagine it's say, but it could be K. Let me know, but thank you. I'll take it. <laughs> so you get the green Savorite gemstone eyes of the snake, which the colors of these Savorite gems is kind of like what you imagine like green grass to be. <laughs> this is mine. That is my prized possession in my whole life. And then with peace and love, she's not going anywhere. <laughs> but like, look, I need this ring. I'm sorry. It's like, maybe I just don't take it off and I walk away with it. <laughs> So if you guys do need different sizes of this, again, you can email me. The size for this one should be in the description. It feels like a five or a five and a half, US five and a half. But again, these are made by our jeweler here. So they are pristine, never before worn. And they do retail for $1,305. So I have it here today for 585 pounds and that is 710 US dollars. All right, I wanna unbox this yellow Fendi box because if you guys thought the blue micro thank you danica you're the best so this one if you want it right now to ship out tomorrow is a us size six all right so if you thought this was a goodie wait till you see what's in this box up here which i am shook that no one has picked this up yet like i get that it's small but it's so cute okay i digress i digress so spoiler alert because i am going to pin this but i love this next piece so much and the price again is silly i hate you guys with the silly prices today to make gifting a little bit easier <laughs> so this is going to come as a box set for you this is the fendi in collaboration with sarah coleman this is known as the mimosa colorway and it is a canvas fendi zuka vertigo so you get the zuka print but it's all trippy <laughs> and this is a baguette belt pouch you can wear it as a crossbody so let me show you guys hopefully i have some yellow girlies in the house because this is pristine and extremely below its retail so this is coated canvas for your exterior paired with silver hardware so you can use it as a bag the strap does attach to the top if you want to rock it that way but you also are able to feed a belt through this loop so you can wear this as a little belt bag and this looks like it will fit yeah it'll fit any size iphone for sure or as a crossbody so this is box set condition level is absolutely fantastic as you guys can see so far absolutely no signs of wear and i love that you get the matte yellow treatment to the front hardware here it's really cool so let me throw the strap on to show you guys. 
actually I want to keep this strap pristine because it has never been used but it does unpop from here you can pop it a couple places and then hypothetically you would put it on like so you get the gist right yeah. <laughs> so let's open this up comes with the dust bag and it's papers inside here's the papers in your dust bag so it's a true full set this should be double the price that I put it at. Here's a look at the interior. You have a black canvas lining for this main pocket and then one inner zip pocket as well. Let's see that. This has no signs of wear. Inside and outside, not a single sign of wear. And again, you could use this just as a clutch or a larger wallet, put the strap on it, make it a crossbody or put a belt through it and make it a belt bag three in one coming as a full set and pristine pristine condition and it's only I, why did i do this i could have priced this at like 995 and it still would have made sense this is 635 pounds that's what happens when i self-moderate you guys 635 pounds which is 771 us dollars silly 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 and and thank you i love these pants so much that i bought them in black too they're like my favorite jeans all right so let me know if there's any questions on this piece you guys and let me know if there are any requests remember you can click on the handbag icon below to take a peek at everything that's in the show today and hit me with any requests jennifer are you a yellow girly someone needs this if neither of these fendi pieces sell today i'm going to be really sad <laughs> they're too good and the price points are silly and this one's a full set like the fact that this is a true full set never used is madness 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 not yet danica i can do that next charnette oh thanks nn charnette let me know do you want tiffany earrings rings necklaces bracelets anything specific from tiffany because i have a ton of tiffany today all right let me box this bad boy back up that one is too good to be on my shelves all right so let's do the chanel bangle which i have slashed the price on which one jennifer not the green one the green one comes as is but the larger black goyard comes as a full set but the this little green guy does not. It'll come with a electric Thomas dust bag, but I did have the Goyard box and dust bag for the big, this one. Lindsay, the yellow? Let me, sh let me test for sure. Let's get like a final for sure answer on that. Okay, where you go? Okay, so iPhone. There we go. Hardware, I do. Yes. All right, so now that this is open, here's your iPhone. Boom, perfect fit. You can see it in there. This is a regular size one. So I don't know about a plus, like the big daddy plus iPhone. I don't know about that. But the regular, I think this is an iPhone 13 with a thick case on fits perfectly. So hopefully you don't have the Big Daddy Plus, as I like to say, apparently, but there we go. All right, yes, let me recap that go yard real quick, then we'll do the Chanel angle. Do -do. Someone has to get the yellow. It's a non-negotiable. I will not be leaving the premises <laughs> until the yellow finds its new home. It deserves love and use and attention. All right, so I'm gonna recap the green go yard pricing you can click on it to see the price again let me know if you need me to copy and paste the price conversion though but here it is so this is your green goyard card holding wallet it is absolutely pristine no exterior signs of wear anywhere she is good to go and then on the other side you get the goyard logo embossed right here three card holders to this side and then you have like an open concept pocket where you can put your id or your business cards. Thanks, Danica. Super cute. No worries, Lindsay. I don't know if I can find bigger for near that price point, <laughs> just to be completely real for that yellow Fendi bag, but I get you, I get you. 
Well, the Chanel phone. Sammy, which which item? Here. No worries, Lindsay. Sammy. If you're asking about the yellow, the Fendi, it fit the standard iPhone 13 with a case on, but I think an iPhone Plus, it might not fit. Let me measure it real quick. Duh, that's why rulers exist. Sometimes I forget about tape measures. I mean, gold Chanel. What Chanel pouch? Oh, this little guy. I haven't shown this one yet. This is like vintage though, I think from the early 2000s. So it's designed for like flip phones. So I'm going to say no to any iPhone fitting in here. But yes, hopefully that's helpful. Sorry, I'm self-moderating today. So everything is up and active, but I haven't shown everything yet. And hello. Yes, absolutely. I'm going to get the measurements of this real quick. This has to go. I'm going to pin it again. Pristine full box set. So it's six and a half inches by about four and a half inches is your dimensions for the yellow. So it's absolutely pristine and it's coming as a full set. You get the box, dust bag, and Fendi papers and the strap, of course. It's in collaboration with Sarah Coleman. So you get this kind of trippy, distorted Fendi Zuka print. It's coated canvas with matte yellow hardware for your front. So you can wear this three ways. You can wear it obviously as a clutch or a little organizer. You can thread a belt through this loop to wear it as a belt bag. And it does come with a matching strap that connects up here. So you can wear this as a crossbody as well. It's pristine. It's a full, full set. No signs of wear. Clean black canvas interior. So, so good. Gigi, of course. Yes. And then just a quick look. I'm not going to attach the strap because the strap has never been undone before. But just hypothetically, sorry, it's kind of curved in. It's literally pristine. <laughs> Let me give you a hypothetical. Hypothetically, you're looking at a strap that comfortably would be crossbody length. So hopefully that's helpful. All right, we had a request for the Chanel bangle and then I will do the diamond pair necklace up next for Gigi. So just two items to get through. Okay, so do our Chanel cuff, which I have shown before. It is a really cool collector's piece, but I did have a cheeky slash at the price for you guys. It's an 03. So this is from 2015. I believe the last time I showed this, it was priced, I think, right around a thousand US dollars. So. It's kind of like a two-sided cuff. So I'll start with the CC side. It is black resin with champagne gold hardware. To this side, you have a three-dimensional interlocking CC fully covered in these little pearl stones. Champagne gold with more little CC detailing here. This is the hinge. So to open, you just slide up and it comes undone. It's in a pristine condition level. The other side is taller. And then you get larger pearls going up it. I think this looks like a chic, bougie um, superhero, like a super women take Chanel type of vibe, if you will. So this will come with its original Chanel box. Let me throw it on. I think in the description, you guys will be able to see like what size wrist this would work best for. So you can either wear it like this, just cool, calm, collected. But then you get this situation. So cute. So you could have it out like this. I think over a black sweater with this thrown atop would be a really chic accessory. You can play around if you want it to face towards your hand or the other way, vice versa. I love this. There is no scratching at all to the resin. No issues to the pearls or the hardware. It's in an excellent condition level. And it is coming with its box. It's circa 2015. And she has been slashed in price. It is now up for 695 pounds, which is 844 US dollars. Customs duties covered, it ships tomorrow morning, and you can use split it. All right, so let me know if there's any questions on that one. Let's do the diamond pair up next for the lovely Gigi. I love saying that name so much. Okay, so let me get this pinned real quick. 
Do, 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 do. This is a great price considering that you're getting over half a carat of a diamond. And it does come with a GIA certificate for this next necklace, which is great and kind of adds to the value. Did you, it opens, so there's a clasp. I can show you again, but you don't have to slip it on. I know that's a concern a lot of the times if you have a larger hand and a smaller wrist. Sometimes bangles can be a little tricky, but this one, you slide this up and it unclasps. So you don't have to contort your hand <laughs> to go through it. Easy in and out situation and it clicks closed nice and secure. All right. So up next, again, this next piece is coming with a GIA certificate for you guys, which fun fact, the GIA headquarters is like a 15, 20 minute drive from where I grew up. It's right next to Legoland, California, which was where I first worked when I was in high school. So I used to drive by the GIA like main location every single day. And now I'm in a whole nother realm of a career, came full circle for me. But this is also from our private jewelers that get really nice diamonds really really nice diamonds and this one is set in 18 carats instead of the 14 carats so you get 18 carats of white gold and it features a 0.51 carat weight pear cut diamond look how nice the quality of this diamond is you guys so you can see all of the diamond specs should be in the description of this piece it's over half of a carat and it's priced at 850 pounds, which is 1,032 US dollars. And, and great question. So right before Luxury Promise, I was doing the same thing on the platform Whatnot independently. So I had already been doing like hosting live shows with luxury products for like around two years. And then before that, I was a college girly. I was a Twitch streamer. I was a model. And then in high school, I did four years like from the minute I could start working, they hired me when I was 15 and a half. So from 15 to age 19, I worked at Legoland, California. I did four different jobs while I was there. I loved it. It was really cute. It was really fun. And then I went to fashion school. That's when I started doing like modeling, Twitch streaming, just little things I could do while still maintaining my grades. And then I worked at Urban Outfitters at one point. And then after I graduated college, I was just full steam ahead in the pre-owned luxury space. So it just kind of worked out. <laughs> All right, so here's another look back at this necklace, you guys. Look how good, like, even though it's just half a carat, it is so fiery and sparkly. Again, Trudy was saying the other day how bad it is to wear white clothes when you're trying to show diamonds, and now I understand. <laughs> but she was saying, yeah, I've lived a lot of different lives in my short little life so far. But hopefully you guys get an idea. I love how sparkly. A, all the prices are set today, unfortunately. Let me triple, triple check. I'll be a little cheeky. Let's see, 15. that one is firm. That's my true, true lowest A. You guys know I always keep it really real with you. I can't go any lower on that one, unfortunately. All right, there we go. That is a look. So let me measure this real quick and then I'll get you guys the price. Thank you, Isabel. So, so sweet. All right, so it does clasp three different lengths. You could do this quite short actually, which I really love. So the longest length is going to be Where am I struggling? There we go. Longest length 8 inches, so 16 inches. Then you could also do it up 7, 14, and then I'm assuming 6. Yeah, so 6, 7 or 8 inches or 12, 14, 16 inches, three different adjustable lengths made by our private jeweler coming with GIA certificate for half carat pear cut diamond. And it is 850 pounds, which is 1,032 USD. Y'all are cheeky. I thought I did so good. Everything's under a thousand pounds. I will take a look. Let's see. Gigi, I, again, I'm being really, really real with you. I can take 10 pounds off if that helps. That's literally like, I'm already at my, like, 
I can take 10 pounds off. So let me know if you are okay with that offer. That kind of helps chip away at the shipping at least. Can't do any more than 10 pounds. If you do want to purchase this though, let me know and I can adjust the price real quick and then I'll let you know when it's ready to go. But that's truly my best. I'm so, so sorry. If I could, I would, but I generally... <laughs> soon i genuinely and generally always try to come at you guys with my true lowest prices to start with so 10 pounds take it or leave it but again if you're a local u.s customer shipping is 15 pounds so that makes shipping five pounds or international shipping is 35 pounds that would make it 25 pounds so let me know if we have a deal on that <laughs> humor me if you will and then let's get into some tiffany are we ready for tiffany tiffany's calling and I will answer unless there's any other specific requests, but okay, I'm going to start with the necklace. I'm, I know Charnette's been on the hunt, so let me get this up real quick. Oh, this has a diamond in it. I didn't even realize. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> this is a good price, if that's the case. <gasps> Gee, do you want to see the pink one? I can do that pink one after this Tiffany piece for you. All right, I'll wait and see what Gigi says. No worries if you don't want to go for it, though. That was just my honest, honest best offer. <laughs> okay, so I have a classic Tiffany & Co. return to Tiffany Diamond necklace. I've had this piece before, but never with a little diamond on it. So it's full sterling silver with 0 0.02 carat weight. There's just a tiny little diamond set into the tag, but the price is really good for this. So I'm going to flip the camera and look, look at this cutie. So you get the heart. Oh my gosh. I know you guys, me and Ellen are diehard lovers and supporters of the Louis Vuitton Hampstead. I don't have any show par today, NN, but I can definitely bring some in the next jewelry show I do. Again, bear with me because I'm not even sure exactly. Sounds good, Gigi. Yeah, just let me know whenever. Um, I honestly don't know exactly what time and what day Sabrina and Sophie are going to be here. So like, I don't want to get too ahead with planning my shows because I'm sure they're going to be doing shows. So hang tight, but worst case scenario, next week I'll for sure do a jewelry branded show for you guys, but I don't really know any details, so we'll see what happens. <laughs> All right, so you get the classic heart-shaped, please return to Tiffany & Co. New York 925, but you get that little 0 .02 carat weight diamond set in here as well. On the back, you get the Tiffany stamp again, and then you have a nice, beautiful, chunky, sterling silver chain. Of course, BB. There we go. So let me throw this on. The clasp is kind of like the size of the clasp, gives it kind of a hidden look. I don't know if you're really looking, you don't notice the clasp, which I tend to like. So let me throw this on. Once I put it on, I'm not going to want to take it off. And you could potentially wrap this around your wrist twice to make it a bracelet or like wear it as like a chain on your belt loops. I've seen a lot of girls do that. Or you can use this as a bag chain or bag charm too. But here it is on. It is so, so cute. Tiffany is the only thing that like converts me to be a silver girly because I'm a gold girly deep inside my heart but I will take out my earrings put in some silver ones in when I want to wear my Tiffany pieces because it's worth it <laughs> so this is super cute it's the first time I've had this with a diamond in it and I priced it without knowing there was a diamond in it <laughs> so consider that a little added bonus I exactly and it's not loud and flashy but it's just so classic cute and I love this length too Charmette. No. I don't have the, another heart, but I do have a round tag bracelet. I have a round tag bracelet with no diamond. But if anyone is interested, let me just triple check. I think this one is just coming as is. Oh no, this does come with the box and the pouch. So totally giftable coming with Tiffany box and pouch. And it is just 465 pounds, which is 500 and roughly 65 US dollars with a diamond. So good. Okay. Let me do the bracelet and then I'll do the Chanel bag for G. Chanel bag is going to match my outfit and I'm going to fall in love with it. I'm already predicting. You guys, thanks for all the love hearts and thanks for being here with me today. I always get nervous when I'm self-moderating. I'm like, what if no one shows up? <laughs> but I appreciate each and every one of you. Okay, so let's do the bracelet option. I also have a cool Gucci bracelet today that I really like. Okay. Oh, 
this is a silly silly price literally jennifer is so good all right so i have the round tag also sterling silver in the bracelet flip the camera and i will give you guys measurements on this because you can clasp it at any length so it's gonna have a max length that it'll work at but then you can do anything below that easily so you get the round tag please return to tiffany co new york 925 other side is plain so you could get this engraved if you wanted to a lot of people will decide to do that and then you just get that same chunky gorgeous sterling silver bracelet for this so let me give you guys measurements So, at its longest, it would be seven and a half inches, seven and a half inches, and then of course you could do anything below that. Let me refresh Tiffany. Mm, okay, now I know, sorry Charnet, I don't know why that like never registered in my brain. Let me check my inventory here just to see if I have it. If I do, I can bring it tomorrow. I haven't seen... Mm, so we do get them in here. Currently, we are all sold out. So I'm definitely going to keep an eye out for you, Charnette. I will email you the minute I get one in. Because we do get them in, it looks like. There's been a flow of them, but they have all sold, unfortunately. So I'll keep my eyes out for you, queen. But if anyone was interested in this bracelet up to seven and a half inch wrist and anything below that it is oh oh i love that daniela that's a good first one all right she's up and available for 235 pounds which is 285 us dollars all right you guys we only have 45 more minutes together because office is going to close at six sharp i'm already making them stay late with me so i gotta be a punctual queen today so let's do my favorite Chanel bag. I cannot understand how this is still here. Price is silly. She is vintage. She is pink. It is all good things. <laughs> Chanel. The price kills me. All right. So this is lambskin leather. It kind of has like a Fendi baguette look to it, but this is vintage Chanel with silver hardware. It is baby pink lambskin and totally matches my outfit today. Stitched in this really cool geometric pattern that like carries on to the top and the back of the bag. It's really unusual. I feel like you don't see this stitch pattern hardly ever. You get the embossed Chanel right here. On the sides at the end of the strap, you have Chanel engraved into the hardware on both sides. And this does adjust by quite a bit. So you could make this longer for a longer shoulder bag or a high crossbody bag. Or just leave it as is to be a cute, perfect, comfy little shoulder bag moment. I love this bag. I think it's so, so good. So condition-wise, she is vintage, but she looks really good. There's no discoloration or dehydrating to the leather. And you even get little feetsies on this guy. So it looks like tiny, tiny amount of corner wear. Some right here and there. So obviously that is reflected in the price opens up like so all pink lambskin interior you do get the chanel dust bag included Ooh, and all of its little chanel papers that's a nice bonus and then it has my all-time favorite chanel lining for the inside of the bag which i don't know if it's weird to have a favorite lining but here i am with my favorite lining <laughs> oh and it comes what the heck this is so good so this is a series eight it does come with its hard card wow and then you get the different size fonts of Chanel for the fabric lining of this bag. You can fit a heck of a lot in here. And then one inner pocket as well. This is good. Coming with hard card, papers, dust bag, and you get a fully visible cereal sticker inside of there as well. This has been one of my favorites for a while and it's made me really sad because she's been here for a hot minute and she doesn't deserve it. <laughs> I don't know why. This bag is still here. I think it's such a good one. And it's like cheaper than a Louis Vuitton bag, genuinely. It's cheaper than a lot of bags and you're getting a Series 8 vintage Y2K-esque Chanel pink lambskin bag, you guys. So if anyone is interested, which my fingers are crossed, 
that someone is. I would still give this like an 8 out of 10 condition level for sure. And she's available for 875 pounds. That's like nothing on Split It. 875 pounds, which is 1,063 roughly US dollars for this bad boy. Justice for this bag. I think this bag really deserves a home. I'm fighting for her. I'm rooting for her. I think it is so, so cute and unique. Okay. So that was her. Hopefully that was helpful for our lovely friend who requested. And then guys, let me know what you want to see. We have roughly 40 minutes left together. Everything is live and active under the handbag icon. So you can take a peek, request what you want to see. Just let me know. Let a girl know. I'm going to do this Prada case next. Another silly, silly price point. There is Lou. I will do the YSL after and then I'll do the Hampstead. But first, I have this really cool Prada black patent leather grommet zip case. Yes, Serena. So I have like a queue of three going on now. So just remind me if I forget you guys, but of course I'll show you guys all of those. Look at this. This is cheaper than a wallet. You get your Prada hardware and then all of these cool little micro studs and grommets to the front. The back of this piece is full. Lindsay, I had the Fendi yellow belt bag and I think that's it as far as true belt bags go today. All right, so there's a back. You get all black patent. Everything is under the handbag icon already live though as I am self-moderating. So take a look through. Let me know if there's anything that catches your eye. So this Prada case is coming with its Prada card. It's coming with its Prada dust bag. So you can absolutely gift this. And it's such a friendly, good price point, you guys. So inside is actually gonna be leather. You have it all black leather interior. And then just to give you guys a size comparison, again, here is an iPhone next to this. So it is quite sizable. You could use this as your makeup bag pencil case whatever it is but she's in excellent condition for just 295 pounds which is 358 us dollars all right so let's do the ysl box then the hampstead and then the fendi belt i also have a gucci belt today and an hermes belt if anyone's looking for a belt i got you okay ysl box let me get this pinned another clutch situation. Let me get this. Four, six. All right. So this is totally, totally giftable as well. Coming in a St. Laurent box. Open it up. Oops. There we go. Ooh, this one's really cute. So it comes with dust bag as well. It is just gonna have branding to the inside, so it's a little bit more quiet. If you know, you know. But this is full black leather with red metallic leather stars stitched atop. Then you have a all black leather backside. This is pristine and it's boxed unused. And you get the Saint Laurent branded silver zip to the top. Ooh. Wow. So inside you get like one, two, six card holders. This is all black canvas interior. You have your inner St. Laurent logo and then one pocket over here as well. So excellent condition on this coming with box and dust bag. And she is available for 335 pounds, which is 406 US dollars. All right, so now we're gonna do the Hampstead and then the Fendi belt. So let me get this Hampstead up. Where is she? Of course, Lou. All right, so I have a Hampstead for under a thousand US dollars in Damier Ben. This is in a really nice condition level for the price, you guys. So 
here is a look like look how nice and gold that front plate is lynn i don't have any crossbody gucci's to oh i have technically you could wear this as a crossbody it's like a gucci vintage bamboo top handle bucket bag that you can wear as a crossbody so let me know if you want me to show that all right but this is coated canvas in the damia ben colorway with reinforced black smooth leather at the corners, obviously gold hardware. You can unbutton and rebutton to the sides, which is, so, this is just such a good bag. Again, Ellen is a huge fan of this. Everyone I know that has a hamstead absolutely loves it. It's just such a good grab and go option to have. So your top handles are super shiny in an excellent condition level. I'll show you guys the corner bits because they are nice. This is a nice one, you guys. Gotcha. Lindsay, shoot me an email about that and I can definitely um, show you some options that I have. They're just not in my show today. And you have a nice clean bottom as well. This is a great one, actually. <laughs> I'm surprising myself with this one for the price point. All right. So this will come with its original old school style Louis Vuitton dust bag for you guys. And then you get a all red lining to the interior of the bag exactly ellen mark jacobs he did not come to play when he was at lv he came out with so many like timeless iconic pieces for the house that still remain just as popular today as they were back in the day he's an icon i love mark jacobs i highly recommend you guys listen to or watch on youtube the emily redikowski podcast the episode where she has mark jacobs on is so insightful like i learned so much from him and just like about taking chances in life and just putting yourself out there it's a really good episode highly recommend so overall i would give this a very solid nine out of ten condition level it's in really really great shape and the price point is incredible at 795 pounds which is 965 us dollars she a goodie a real goodie see. Alright, so next request was the Fendi belt, I believe. So let me go for that next. And then let me know if there's any other requests, you guys. We have about like 34 minutes left together. I am here to help. Okay, so let me get the Fendi belt up next. Isn't it so good, Ellen? Fendi belt, Fendi belt, Fendi belt. Where are you? Um, I do have a Chanel belt today too, you guys. Where is this Fendi belt? Why am I not seeing it? There we go. <laughs> Apologies. Fendi belt. There we go. Okay. I have a black leather and Zuka canvas motif reversible belt. So kind of a two in one situation. This is just gonna come as is for you guys, just as a heads up, but you will get a luxury promise dust bag with this, of course. So give me one second. This is a nice, good size, you guys. Exactly, Ellen. <laughs> That's a really good point. So this has a matte black FF buckle, and then to one side of the belt, you have the classic, iconic Zuka print done in canvas. But if that is too flashy for you, you're not a logomania type of person, you can flip the buckle to the other side, and then you get a black pebbled leather belt, which would look really slick with the matte black buckle. So let me get a measurement on this for you guys. Again, it is just coming as is. In the Gucci box up here is a pouch, and this one down here is going to be a belt. I believe it is men's. But of course, belts are going to be unisex always but I think this is a men's collection piece. So it looks to be about 39 inches up to 43 inches. Of course, 
if those inches are too big for you, you could add additional holes to make it tighter, but 39 to 43 inches roughly. The true size should be in the description of this piece if you guys click on it. Of course, Emma, yeah. But that is her, you guys. So this belt is two in one, reversible, up and available for 295 pounds, which is 358 US dollars. All right, so let me do a quick recap on that product clutch. And then for the Fendi wallet, do you mean the gray one, the little gray one, Emma? Let me know which wallet it is, not the blue, correct? Right. So the Prada clutch is coming with its dust bag and its hard card gotcha, Emma, of course. It's an excellent condition level, absolutely pristine. So the front of this, again, I'll give you the size reference of an iPhone paired next to it so you can see just how much you can really fit in here. It's actually a great size clutch without looking too big, I would say. So it's black patent leather, but to the front you get the silver hardware Prada surrounded by little studs and micro grommets. The back of this clutch is just all smooth black patent, silver Prada branded top zip, dust bag, Prada hard card, included and then inside of this bad boy it's actually lined with leather just a big pocket lined with black leather inside yeah of course three and it just remind me if i forget i got you so this was excellent condition the price point was fantastic let me repin it for you emma so you can take a look see all right, so it is pinned again so you can click and view additional details on this piece, but hopefully that is helpful for this clutch. And then let me do the wallet up next for you. Do, do. There we go. Great. This is a real good one, really good price. Isn't it good, Emma? I would definitely rock that just as a handheld clutch. It's really stunning. Okay. So this next Fendi wallet is going to come with its box, so definitely a giftable option for you guys. Let me open her up. It is such a cutie. It comes with its little Fendi papers as well. It's like a dovey gray. Mariana, yes, remind me. Emma, if you get both, I will refund shipping on one of them, so you just pay for shipping once and they will both ship out to you tomorrow. So here is a 360 look at this Fendi wallet gray smooth leather with a F detail in silver hardware. So it's kind of a two-sided situation. So the front opens up, you get a little card holder or coin pouch, or you can put your house key in here, whatever you want to put. But that is your front pocket, button snaps nice and secure. And then the other side opens up as a trifold. And then it's really cool. So the card holders, like for your credit card and stuff, are actually hidden in this pocket. And then you can put cash, receipts, whatever it is inside of here. But I like that they chose to just do a flat strip of leather versus having the card holders to the front. Keeps your cards a little bit more secure and out of sight. So good. All right, so those were... Oh, let me get... Oh, I did get the price up. Okay, so it's pinned. And this one... Emma, yes, your customs and duties are covered if you purchase during the live show. Shipping is 35 pounds and it'll ship out tomorrow. So this is 225 pounds, which is 273 US dollars. So the next request I saw was for the gold Chanel pouch. And then I will do the Goyard card holder recap for you, of course. Okay. Oh, and someone wanted to see the um, necklace again. Sorry, guys, I'm all over the place. Don't feel bad reminding me if you need to remind me. I don't take offense, if anything, I encourage it because I'm all over the place always. So let's do the Chanel Gold little holder organizer guy. So this is from the early 2000s, so it's kind of dated in the sense of you actually fitting an iPhone in it nowadays, but pe people will still use this as like a wallet substitute or just as a little organizer. It was 39 to 43 inches, Jen. If you click on the icon for it, the measurements should be in the description as well. But I measured with the tape measure and it was 39 to 43 inches. Yes, E, remind me. You guys, there's a lot of requests. I'm working in order. So don't feel bad, remind me. So I have this Y2K era metallic gold lambskin Chanel phone holder, if you will. So here's a 360 look at this. You get champagne gold, 
actually no just a normal gold interlocking cc detail so this unbuttons and then upon opening this I'll show you guys this is actually really handy to just throw in a purse for organizational purposes oh it comes with its hard card too so you get three pockets two open concept ones once it is unbuttoned and then down the middle you have your card holder it's a series 18 and you have a fully visible serial code this is actually in an excellent condition level like it genuinely looks unused there's no corner wear no bottom wear no issues to the lambskin she's a goodie i definitely recommend this one you guys and let me know if there's any questions but it is up and available for 595 pounds which is 722 us dollars okay and guys just a reminder i do have to end the live a little early today in about 25 minutes so if you have recap requests questions on anything if you want your customs and duties purchase you do have to purchase during the live so let me know how i can help all right so i did that one the next was a goyard card holder for diana so this one just comes as is diana but it's an excellent condition level no signs of wear it is the saint mark hand painted in the green colorway again there is not a single sign of wear to this bad boy. It's in an excellent, excellent condition level. Upon opening, you have your Goyard logo embossed right here. Three card holders to this side and then an open concept. Yes, Serena. Open concept card pocket here, maybe to put your ID or like a work scan key card, whatever it is, but this is an excellent, excellent condition level. All right, so I'm working in order. So that was a Goyard card holder. B, there is no movement on the toiletry pouches. <laughs> Sadly, I did look. They are priced as low as I could go on them. Uh, so I'll do the diamond necklace and then the Gucci pouch. Okay, diamond necklace. So this is 0.51 carat of diamonds. It is the color FSI2 clarity and it is done in 18 karat white gold, pear cut diamond. <laughs> It comes with its GIA certificate. This comes straight from our private jeweler here in New York City. Again, all of the specs will be listed as well as additional images so you can see it more detailed. Once I get this pin, just click to view all of the details. But you could wear this three different lengths. I believe it was 12, 14, or 16 inches total. That's about a six, seven, or eight inch drop length. So let me show you the diamond first. A little over half of a carat. Pear cut gorgeous and it does come with its gia cert specific to this diamond there we go joe yes just remind me after this one i have to do the gucci pouch and then i will do those for you that is her on the 18 karat white gold chain definitely please 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 click on it view the images and the description but it is priced so well for half a carat and 18 karat white gold it was under a thousand pounds with its GIA cert. It's super duper duper sparkly. Like it's a really, really nice diamond, you guys. And I love the setting of it. It's open to the back so the light will go all the way through, which gives it that beautiful fieriness. And it looks really clear too. All right, I know, I agree, BB. The cut was cut in a smart manner. It makes it look really big. All right. Yes, Serena, yeah, you can do 12 inches, which is going to be more like a chokery or like high collarbone length, which would be stunning to stack with. All right, so someone wanted to see the Gucci pouch, which I got you. So this one is coming with its box. Let me find it. Do -do. That is... Coming with its box price below retail from Gucci. Let me open this up. Also comes with its dust bag. Wow, this feels like brand new. <laughs> so it is the Marmont zip pouch. So you get the brushed gold interlocking GG hardware front and center, the classic Marmont zigzag print, not print, stitch pattern into the leather, if you will. And then you do get the really cute classic heart detail to the back. No free shipping, unfortunately, Jay. I do think Sabrina called that off earlier in the day. So no free shipping, unfortunately, but everything I have in the show is priced below a thousand pounds. All right. So there's a look at the top zip. You get a leather zip pull. 
open it up. This is genuinely so nice. <laughs> real, real nice. So there is just a little bit of discoloration to the interior, which is reflected in the price point. Again, no one's really going to stick their head in here and look. But of course, I'm going to call that out to you guys. So just a couple tiny little baby marks inside. But the exterior is absolutely pristine. And it is available for £455, which is $552 US dollars, coming as a full set. All right. So Joe wanted to see the other two Goyard pieces. I think I just had... I just had, oh yeah, 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 the big one. Okay, yeah, I haven't done this big one yet. And then the other one was the other pouch. So let's do the new one first, which is done in canvas. And it's a nice large size. I think it's meant to be like a bag organizer inside of the St. Louis tote, which is really nice. So it's a cotton linen necessaire <laughs> organizer. So it's a natural undyed cotton and linen mix, but you get the brown, like a coffee brown and a caramel brown stripe detail that carries all the way around. To the front, you have the Maletier Depuis 1853, E. Goyard Paris 233, Rue Saint-Honneur, the original flagship store address. It's in an excellent condition level, fits inside of a Louis Vuitton Neverfull. Again, a Goyard St. Louis tote, you can use it as a clutch, or a really great travel organizer too. So you have the little silver zip pull right here. Oh my gosh, I am so happy, you guys. I just saw it sold. Again, sorry if I was delayed because I am self-moderating, but someone has picked up the Cutie Fendi wallet and a very special friend of mine has gotten that incredible Tiffany necklace with the diamond. So these two pieces will be on their way to you guys tomorrow. Thank you so much for shopping with me and supporting me, especially when I have to self-moderate. I'm always a little bit scared when I have to self-moderate. So lots of love. Congrats to the purchasers. Great choices. Great choices. Yay. Okay, that just made my day. Now I can relax. <laughs> but let me show you guys the interior. Yay. Also, you guys, I just wait until I post my Halloween costume tomorrow on Instagram. You guys are not ready for what I did this year. Emma, well done, lovely. Thank you for hopping on and putting your trust into me and shopping with me. Such a good one. Like seriously, that was a really good purchase. So well done. And let me know when you receive it, if you love it. All right. Leah, Gucci wallet. What does it look like? I don't see a Gucci wallet. Do you mean the pouch? I'll take a look for you. But nice clean interior for this Goyard pouch. She's available for 650 pounds, which is 789 US dollars. All right, and let me quickly recap the other Goyard pouch. And then we'll look at the Gucci item for Leah. Yay, Shirley. Love you, queen. You know I love you. <laughs> no worries, Leah. Yeah, I'll show you. Shirley, send me pictures when you get it. It was such a good one. Like, I priced it without knowing there was a diamond in it. <laughs> So, good pick, girl. <laughs> All right. Yay. All right, so a quick recap on the Gucci Marmont pouch. So it comes with its box and its dust bag. So it can totally, totally be giftable. Oh, and then I'll do the other Goyard recap. Sorry, I'm all over the place, you guys. <laughs> this is for Leah. So the original Gucci dust bag also included in here. And the exterior is in pristine condition. There's just a couple tiny marks to the interior, which you could get cleaned. I personally wouldn't mind, but you can easily get it cleaned. But you have the leather with the Marmont stitching, brush gold hardware for the interlocking GG, leather pull for the zip. Comes with its little Gucci papers as well, actually. And then the interior. There we go. What did I say, Emma? Oh, I was talking to, I think I was talking to Shirley because she got that Tiffany necklace with the diamond and I was just emphasizing the fact that I didn't know it had a diamond in it when I set the price. So it was a nice low price point for a Tiffany diamond, which is incredible. 
All right, so hopefully that's helpful, Leah. Let me know if you have any other questions on this one. Again, I do have to end the live 15 minutes early, so we have about 17 minutes left. It is live, so I'll try to help you guys in hyperspeed, but everything is live. You guys can scroll through to take a look. And then let me quickly recap the other Goyard pouch, which this one also will come with its box and its dust bag. Honestly, between the two, between this one and the cotton one, I think that this one is the one I would go for because you're getting the whole set and it's a little bit cheaper. That's just me. But you get the yellow Goyard dust bag and this was in like a true, true pristine condition level on the shelf. Leah. Oh, I have a Gucci belt, classic Gucci belt. <gasps> Lynn, you're right. Let me do the Dior next. I have a whole Dior bag for a... I don't want to say S-T-U-P-I-D, but it is S-T-U-P-I-D, the price point. <laughs> I'll do that next. But here is this other Goyard pouch. You get the orange and cream stripe detail, plain on the other side with the chocolate brown piping all around. This had just a tiny, tiny bit of discoloration inside, Goyard papers included. So just a tiny, eensy bit of discoloration to the bottom in there. And then you get a brown leather card pocket inside of here. So that was that one. All right, let's do this Dior unboxing. This is crazy. I'm gonna pin it. You guys will see what it is before I show it. That's just the name of the game, but it is so good. And the price is literally silly. Actually, the picture didn't load. So that works in my favor. <laughs> Love that for me. Ugh, what am I doing with this price, you guys? It's a whole Dior bag with a box. Look at that price. I am a nut for this. <laughs> so you get your Dior box. Big old Dior box included. So this will have some signs of wear, hence the price point. But honestly, for the price, this is still an amazing, amazing find. So this is our Black Canage Lambskin Leather Granville Chain Link extra large tote from Dior. Look how gorgeous the hardware detailing is where the straps go. The straps are heavy in the best way possible. It's full like chain link situation going on. And then of course you have the blown up signature canage pattern into the leather for the bottom portion of the bag. So here is worn on the shoulder. Any size laptop would fit in here. This would be a great commuting bag, whatever it is. Oh! Oh my gosh. Yeah. Surely you know a good deal when you see one and I applaud you for that. And again, next month we are celebrating you guys. November seems to be an important month for a lot of us. So I'm excited. All right. So for this tote, you guys, you get four feet to the bottom. Main condition call out is the corners do have rub on them. Of course you can use a black leather polish to touch this up or if you wanted to take it to a call where you could, but again, for the price point, I would just use it as is and then just have a carefree bag. Like, I'm not going to have to baby this or worry about it. That's just me, though. <laughs> so you do get two, ex actually, yeah, two. Little pocket to the front here and a little pocket to the back side here. There is going to be minor marks to the leather throughout. Again, some black leather polish will work wonders on that. So kind of a DIY easy fixer upper, if you will. All right, let me open it up. So you do have the magnetic button snap to keep this closed wow the lining is fully leather too so this is a whole leather situation you have two little pockets this side your dior logo is right up here as well as here and then you have another zip pocket to this side so i would overall give this like a 7.7 .7 out of 10 condition level fully functional no damage just some light signs of it being pretty loved but then again you instantly have a lived in easy breezy grab and go dior tote for like half of the price of what it should be you guys coming with its box so if you are interested she is available for 695 pounds which is 844 usd which is kind of bananas if you ask me okay <laughs> Oh, you guys, so many birthdays coming up. Emma, are you a Scorpio as well? What's your zodiac sign? I like knowing y'all zodiac signs. 
Do I have any Tauruses in the house, or am I the sole lonely Taurus today? All right. So that was our Dior unboxing, you guys. We have like 12 minutes left to go. So now is the time to get me your request, what you want to see. I can't believe no one asked about my Tiffany rings. I have Tiffany rings for like a hundred US dollars, basically. I have a Gucci bracelet, Tiffany ring. Let's see. Lots of Tiffany rings. I have a Tiffany ring with a diamond. Let me do this ring. All right, I'm gonna get this ring up for you guys. Everything will be live. I mean, it already is live, so after the show too, if there's anything you're thinking about, it will still be up and available for you guys. Oops, let me get this fixed. There we go. Let me find this ring. There we go. So I at least got to show one of these options because the price points are incredible. All right. So. This is coming with its pouch and it is in collaboration or designed by Paloma Picasso for Tiffany & Co. And this is the double loving heart ring. So kind of an in infinity symbol motif, if you will, but with her iconic loving heart design. So you get the two hearts interwoven like an infinity, sterling silver. You get this nice, beautiful little twist to the sides. If someone can help me out, the size should be in the description of this piece. I think it might be a US 5, kind of feels like a US 5 if I can get it on my pointer finger, but she's sterling silver and the price point is just correct. <laughs> it's just a really good price, really good giftable option. She is available for 155 pounds, which is 188 US dollars. I might just like speed run through all of the Tiffany rings real quick. Actually, I wanna do this necklace too. Let me do the necklace first. All right, let me get this necklace up. Mm -hmm. Sweet. All right. So I do have a graduated ball necklace from Tiffany. No worries. Yeah, of course, Leah. Thank you, Jane. Let me hold this and I can measure it for you too, Leah. So here is a size, just a look at the size in general. I'll show you with a phone held up next to it. And then let me get you the measurements real quick. So this Gucci pouch, we'll measure in at, it's about 11 and a quarter, actually more like 11 and a half inches, 11 and a half inches by, like seven and a half. So seven and a half by 11 and a half inches is the dimensions for that Gucci pouch. So hopefully that is helpful, Leah. Show you guys this other Tiffany necklace. Of course, that's what I'm here for, queen. <laughs> so this will come with its pouch as well. I always love this piece. And I haven't had it in the graduated version in a while. So it's full sterling silver, Tiffany & Co. Just round sterling beads. You get the little Tiffany Co. charm along the clasp. But I just think this looks so good on. It's a really good stackable option. It's just beautiful for my silver girlies out there. So she is available for 445 pounds, which is 540 US dollars. All right. else can I show you guys? Let me know if there's any recap requests, of course. Let's see, let's see. Today was a whirlwind. <laughs> oh, I want to show this Gucci, Gucci knife, or bracelet too. Of course, surely, yeah. Just a heads up, I might not get to it immediately because I'm gonna have to pack up and bounce out of here real quick, but it's good that it's on my brain. Nothing under a hundred pounds, L. The closest I have is Tiffany rings that are a little bit over a hundred pounds, but nothing under a hundred pounds. All right, let me show this Gucci bracelet real quick. This 
this is a good price too if I have any Gucci lovers. Of course, surely. Alright, so this is a Gucci Gigi cutout heart charm bracelet coming with this box and its pouch. It kind of has a Tiffany look to it, if you will, but it is Gucci. So let me flip the camera. Ye old camera. <laughs> so you get this nice, big, heavy silver heart charm with a G for Gucci done into it. So this side is just smooth hardware and the back side you get the Gucci engraved down at the bottom. But it's just going to be kind of like a charm bracelet if you will. So you get the big Gucci charm. Looks like Tiffany but it's Gucci. And the price is great at £295 which is $358 US dollars. Let's see. Oh yeah of course of course. I'll just measure this bracelet real quick. It's gonna be eight inches at its longest. It's so good, Sally. It's so good. I can't believe it's still here. Coming with you guys, Acer, too. Eight inches at its longest, but of course you can clasp anywhere below that for this. Okay. So, for L, I had just shown the one. So this one was a little bit over 100. Where'd it go? Where'd she go? Here it is. So this comes with its pouch. I'll just pin it for you. L, if you click on it, you'll be able to see the pricing. But this was a US size five and a half sterling silver Paloma Picasso for Tiffany & Co. Interlocking kind of infinity loving heart ring. So that was close to a hundred pounds. And then the other one I have is even closer because it is an itty bitty baby tiny size. This next one I pulled with the thought of it being good for a pinky ring, okay? <laughs> I had a pinky ring situation on the brain, but it is just a smidge bit over a hundred. This next one is priced at 115 pounds, which is 100 and roughly 40 US dollars. It is a size, I think like a three and a half US. So I pulled it with the thought of it being a pinky ring, but it's really cute. You get the little loving heart by Paloma Picasso set in the center there. And then I just think it would make a really good pinky ring. It's actually a little big on my pinky. Let me show my other pinky. Oh, this pinky is even smaller. Gosh, I swear my fingers aren't that small, but. <laughs> Ideal for a pinky ring, and it's only 115 pounds. <laughs> That's a throwback moment. <laughs> I haven't thought about those guys in a hot minute. Alrighty, guys, I only have four minutes left with you, so I am calling it. If anyone has any last minute recaps, let me know. Um, I'll extend your customs and duties being covered up until 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Times. Thank you, Jane. So the ring size for that last one was a 3.75 US, but. This is your final call, last call, last moments to let me know. If you're checking out on anything, let me know so I can stay on until you get it. And if not, I'll be back tomorrow. I don't know if Sabrina and Sophie will be joining me tomorrow. There's a possibility. I don't know what time they land, so we'll have to wait and find out together. <laughs> but I am scheduled for another show, same time as today. Due to the upcoming time change that's like affect affecting the global team, my shows are pushed back later for now. So they are 4 to 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time in anticipation for the upcoming time change, if that makes sense, you guys. So thank you all for joining me. It's been a pleasure. I will see you guys tomorrow. Email me if you have any questions. I got to clean up and I got to bounce. So see you guys on Halloween. I am going to wear a Halloween costume. I'm hoping the other host tomorrow wears something Halloween-y. If not, I'm just going to show up looking crazy. So don't fail me. I'm going to be a cat and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Happy 